Congratulations, you're the first people to visit Ark Song Lodge and Resort. Look, guess what that is. And we're wearing hard hats because we're about ready to go inside and take a look around the new Heart Song Resort out here at Dollywood. Let's go wait. I can't wait to go peek inside, see what they got. You ready? Yeah, let's go on. This Heart Song Adventure That Rocks. It's really exciting to get a chance to show you Heart Song and Lodge uh, campus for the first time. It's been under construction for almost eight months and it involves 28 acres of property for the Heart Song uh, Resort. Really big differences between where we were at Dreammore and where we are today. Think of it like Dolly's big family. It's not one brother or sister is better than the other. This is adding up for uh, really different kinds of deluxe experiences for what we aim to be as a preeminent destination resort. Hey, this would be the opening as you're going in and possibly the front doors. I mean, I'm not sure. I guess they're going to tell us. And then maybe this is the main lobby area. Of course, that is just my guess for right now. I mean, we could be walking into the kitchen area for all I know. So the entrance we came in is actually going to be a dedicated trolley entrance. So you'll be able to go there and ride the trolley over to the parks. Never have to move to the park. That area that we did walk through happens to be where the trolleys are going to pick you up and drop you off when you guys go and check out Dollywood. Now, this will be the entrance lobby, so that kind of helps you get an idea of where you're at. You can see the renderings here. The port of the chair will be kind of in this area here. And this will be a, a fireplace that will be in the lobby that's ahead. So, back in June of last year, Eugene and Dolly made the announcement that we have a 10 year, half billion dollar expansion plan that will take place over the next 10 years. Um, this is the first project as part of that. Come to the Smoky Mountains to enjoy the beautiful outdoors. And Dreamboard doesn't have any outdoor patios, but Heart Song will. Almost half of the suites on property will actually have balconies for you to be able to enjoy and, and add some outdoor experiences to. We're standing in the little, in the middle of a, a four story atrium that will have an enormous fireplace as a feature to the interior of the resort and it'll be unlike anything that you've ever seen before. Just to uh, show you the current construction going on right now. Now I believe the pole's gonna be over there. Probably way over there. This area right here that you see, this big rectangle, I believe it's gonna be the fireplace. Like I said, we're standing in the lobby area right now. Ask us what's the difference between Dreamor and Heart Song, and is one better than the other? When you go to Dreamor, it's like visiting Dolly's home, and it helps you really learn about the hospitality that she would show you if you were visiting her house. It's a little bit of glitz and glamour associated with it. Heart Song gives us a chance to tell you Dolly's story about where she goes to get refreshed. It's about her love of the Smoky Mountains. You know, she spent an entire career writing songs, more than 3,000 of them, related to the Smoky Mountains. So this is our chance to show you what it's like when she goes to get refreshed uh, in the Smoky Mountains. We're going to have a little more than 300 rooms here. What do we do to fill all of those rooms? This is really different. You know, in terms of our, our approach, we have 26,000 square feet of convention space that actually, if you were to walk down the main lobby and head out that way, that's where the convention side of the resort is going to be. It's going to provide us a really unique opportunity to cater to some really large groups of people that we haven't been able to do before an idea of the scope of this project I mean this is an enclosure of a building here 
and you come down here, you see another structure over there. But wait till I turn this wall so you can get a good idea on how big this is gonna be. I mean, if you just follow the pavement across the ground. This is really about experiencing the Great Smoky Mountains. The group's facility that's going to be here, the convention space here, is in between the size that we have for the great uh, convention centers that we have that are in the three cities and in Knoxville. Uh, so it's it's smaller than that, but it's in, it fills a niche in this market that's going to provide us an opportunity for uh, great corporate events, large weddings, other in-between events. I'm not sure if she's standing in the lobby area. I think it's on the other side of this fireplace. I don't know if this is the wall right here of the fireplace, but I believe they said like where we were standing earlier and that's where everyone is in the blue shirts. That's the lobby. So then where Ryan is from Adventures Out There, he's actually warming himself up by the fire right now. Camping at Dollywood coming soon. Right now I'm standing on the site of Heart. You gotta check this out from the president of Dollywood Park and Resorts. You know, you heard Dolly and I announced a half a billion dollars investment. We actually have master plans for five different resorts on our, on our property. Long-term vision to, when someone thinks about a vacation, who we want them to start thinking about, you know, coming to Pigeon Forge and coming to Dollywood Parks and Resorts. And it's a great chance for us to connect the stories of Dolly's life inside of all of our resorts. When Eugene talks about a, a master plan of five resorts and a campground on this particular campus, you know, that really gets us uh, started on that destination experience so that uh, we can have guests not only from the United States, but also international guests. That's a part of, the, that's a part of our 10 year um, uh, plan, you know, for this area. Obviously, when you come to the Smokies, that's a very popular and growing uh, part of visitation and tourism. So we think there's a perfect opportunity for us to be able to leverage that type of experience here. What did you think about Hearts on Construction? That is amazing. They've done a lot more than I expected them to have done already. I'm so excited. I'm excited too. I mean, it's <laughs> so gonna be cool. an incredible facility. And if you don't recognize this guy, Butch, from Hanging with the Crazy Crew, you gotta check his channel out. And the Crazy Pop has some incredible cooking. Come we can't on. wait. Well, we want to. We want to do a hamburger cooking challenge at his place. We're gonna put his link in the description yes. down below. Yes. Thank you so much for coming out and joining us out here on the construction crew. If you haven't hit that like and subscribe yet. What you waiting for? Because you really this. never know where we're gonna end up next. Make each and every day, including those where you can make a lot of memories and, and adventure, adventure that rocks. rocks.